is a beautiful morning, the sun is just peeping out. Some birds already started looking for their breakfast. This golden light glittering all over the water. Wow! A day cannot start better than this. Some birds are still hesitating to start their day. My name is Oriental Darter. People call me the snake bird. Let's have a closer look of myself. A head, which has a long beak and a telescopic eyes. Followed by, a long flexible neck. A body, which covered by my feathers now. My feathers are black in color, decorated with white lines. Finally a fan-shaped tail. It's time to show off, with my feathers open. I have huge wings compared to my body size. These huge wings will help me while taking off from water. The fan-shaped tail, helps me to direct myself, when I swim underwater. I have a long flexible neck. As I have explained, all about my appearance. It's time to show some action sequences. Before that, I will explain you, my fishing technique. I go underwater, search for a fish. When I find one, I will lock on that fish, and chase it. When I am in a good range, I will spear the fish with my beak. Then I come out of water, shake my beak, until the fish comes my beak's edge. Then I will toss the fish in air and swallow it. It is not that simple. Let me show you, with a bigger fish. Now, I got a better sized fish. The first challenge for me, is to shake the beak with fish weight, until it comes to my beak's tip. Once it is there, I will toss the fish, and catch it with my beak. You can see, the fish is trying to escape. The second challenge for me, is to hold the fish, until I get a better grip, to swallow it. You can see the fish going through my long neck. Let me show some more action sequence will not be on my side all the time. There are some moments, where I struggle, to swallow the fish, and some moments, where I miss the fish itself. I juggle the fish, before swallowing it. Toss the fish, from one side to the other, until I get a better grip. This happen only while handling big fishes. Sometimes, I spear the fish on face, and I go underwater to swallow it. You can see, I speared this fish on tail. So if I miss this fish while tossing, it will survive. This bring extra conscious to my mind, and sometime it results in missing the fish. I have shown enough examples. It's time to sit and relax. Meanwhile I will explain you, about the birds, with whom I share my feeding ground. Yes, with birds of my own species. We usually breed in colonies. We also share our feeding ground, with herons and cormorants. Cormorants, are very important ones. Because, they also use, similar hunting technique as mine. But they hold the fish with its beak, instead of spearing it. My competitors are around. I have to swallow the fish really quick. If I delay, there are chances, to lost the fish to them. This strike my mind really hard, and pushes me to act fast. But sometime, I miss the fish, in this hurry burry state. Yes, I have buddies, mate, and competitors from my own species. We usually fight for fishing territories, and also for courtship activities. As we breed in colonies, fight will not be that intense. Most of the times, it will be just pushing them out. Bond monogamously, at least for one breeding season. There are different types of displays used. Males try to attract females by, raising their wings to wave them, in an alternating fashion, or bowing, or snapping the bill, or giving twigs to potential mates. To strengthen the bond, partner will rub their bills, or wave. Then point upwards 
or bow their necks. Somehow, the mates felt, it is not the right day. Name Snake Bird, refers to my long thin neck, which has a snake-like appearance, when I swim with my body submerged. Or when we mate, we twist the neck, during bonding display. I am trying to understand myself better, by looking, at my own reflection. Thank you.